So I'm going to tell you my most shameful secret, and then the good news. Shameful secret's not really my shame. This place I live in has bed bugs. It's one of the things I don't talk about, but it really bothers the hell out of me. It bothered me more when I first moved here, but once I started doing my god shit, the ontological radiation started repelling them. No bed bugs anywhere on my shit. Just this little radius surrounded with the god shit. And, you know, me personally, all of, just all emitting ontological radiation. It's hard to, it doesn't really roll off the tongue. God radiation? That's easier to say. It's not exactly accurate, though, because all this stuff is emitting it, and that stuff isn't God, so is it God radiation? Well, I don't know, Ray, those are physical objects touched and marked by the hand of the Almighty. I mean, so, you know, I'm not a, I'm not a fucking philosopher. My point is, I haven't been... Waking up with any bites on me, I look through all my shit, the bed bugs are gone. It's because there's some low ontology bullshit. They probably just flicker out of existence or some shit. Or maybe everybody else is just stinkier than me. That is also a valid theory. Either way, it's nice to have, like, one less thing annoying the living shit out of me. And then I don't have my jiggling fat, so that's not annoying the living shit out of me. I mean, just those two things free up some of my brain energy to be cheerful. I manage my brain like a bank because I don't have that ability to just say shit and then just act like it's so. That would be a handy trick. It's like, oh, I mean, you know, I'll just think things and then, you know, it'll all be okay. No, I just assess things. Like, that's how I was before the god shit and that's how I've been after the god shit because that's how I am. Like, like, determining that there's no psychic powers, there's no magic healing crystals, there's no spirits, right? Really going through that and putting in the work and saying, all right, I have concluded that this shit is not real. Well, by the same token, you know, I'm going through my god stuff. Everybody's too much of a moron to really fucking... I, I mean, I just bounced shit off of people. That's what they're for. They're there for me to bounce shit off of and then figure it out myself. No offense. I mean, thank you, actually. It is a vital a vital function. I need, like, a human-looking thing to say shit at so I can then come to all the conclusions myself. Also, at work, they got some new help in my area, so I'm not having that thing where I have multiple things that I have to do and I'm stressed out, like trying to fix several broken machines simultaneously while keeping shit from piling up. They've got a they've got a guy for the keeping shit from piling up things so I can just focus on fixing the machines. And all of these nice things really started happening around the time I started doing my god shit. So it really it looks to me like I'm being given an, a pretty obvious incentive paradigm. It's like Ray. You can be a fat bedbug written written <laughs> a fat bedbug bitten overworked son of a bitch who doesn't do god shit or Ray you can just do the god shit and be happy. It's your choice, man. It's what a, That's the incentive paradigm it looks like I'm being given. Yeah, I mean, I know that sounds superstitious, but it's kind of funny how, like, I start doing god shit and just everything fucking turns around. Like, I was being punished and now I'm being rewarded. It's what it feels like.